flight doesn't leave for a long time. So bye bye. They will see you me. <laughs> What's right? How you doing? Good, how are you? <laughs> but I don't. Please go and check it. I'll link it up. This morning, but don't follow my standards. This is the Skyliner towards Narita Airport. Make sure you buy a separate ticket because I had no idea. Um, and you have to buy a separate ticket as, as well as pay to come into the train station via cash or your Sika card. So I need to figure out where my seat is because there's all reserved seats. But I did buy snacks. I bought a bunch of snacks. It's about to be an hour train ride. I'm so excited to see the views. I'm gonna actually ask for help so I can find my seat. I'll be right back. I'm really glad I'm actually heading to Narita. I mean, it's my only choice to be honest. But I'm super glad because one, I have a window seat. You can't see anything now. But in the second, it's gonna be above the ground. And we can talk. I think we can talk on here. Don't quote me. But there's a lot of people talking and they're Japanese. So, yay! Just don't forget, you need this ticket to be on this train. I think this is the perfect way to end off my Tokyo vlog. The train ride is Once above ground. I'm going to see a lot of city tomorrow. views and country views and I love it. So I got the train, this Ichigo sandwich. And I got this sandwich. I mean, this it's like a cream paste custard sandwich. It's so interesting to explain, but I had it with an IA. I don't know if you guys remember it. And then I got um, an onigiri and caramel latte from yesterday. And this is my favorite. I love this. I also have a water in my bag and some more snacks in case I need it. More people are coming on. Once you board the train, please wait until you are so, seated. Please I need to move this back. Enjoy the views and I'll see you when I get to the airport. <laughs> Finally get to try takoyaki, which I was telling you guys about yesterday. So I'm here shopping in the airport because I cannot check in yet because there is nowhere to check in. The earliest flight doesn't leave for a little while, so there's quite literally nowhere to check in. So I can't drop my bag off, so I can't leave the airport because I can't wander around with three bags. It's just too much. So I'm up on the, it's almost like a fourth floor of the airport and it's a shopping and dining area and they have a lot of stores a lot of bookstores a lot of gift shops like a bunch and i look over and i see this fast food nippon fast food and i see takoyaki i'm like yep it's meant to be so finally got it let's try it out let me get my chopsticks ready
I'm currently in the line to check my bags. I could do it elsewhere, but I want to find out the liquid size requirements because I'd like to carry my little bag that I always hang in the bathroom. But then I realized when I came through, I was already in uniform. So the size requirements didn't relate to me. But now I'm full on passenger. I need to figure out if I can bring those because I would hate to reach where I need to reach and have to throw everything away and I would cry. So yeah, that's it. The gates are finally open. Well, not open, but everybody's finally lining up. We start boarding in like another two hours. So perfect timing, perfect timing. <sighs> I'll see you guys when I get to the gate. Bye. Waiting at the gate. I'm going to end the vlog off here. Make sure you like, comment, share, and subscribe. And stay tuned for more. And thank you so much for watching. Hi B squad, it is my birthday weekend or birthday week actually end because my birthday is April 7th and it falls on a Sunday so it's not really the weekend it's the very end the very last leg of it um we're heading to west milan and we're stopping in old harbor to get some drinks before we head out on the toll i have um, a seafood boil right here i'm 28 today and uh, yeah i've been really sad but i'm gonna try my best to you know get some recordings and other things I'm gonna try to get enough to create a video for you guys um, my Japan vlog was supposed to come out today but I'm not finished with it and I really want it to be great um, my computer is moving a bit slow it's like over three hours worth of footage almost over four hours really worth of footage but I'm trying my best it'll come out when it comes out and here's Chad so Last night, Chad punctured the two front tires. To the two um. Shady fog. Shady fog. I forgot to buy two tires. Shady fog. It was not a fun birthday, and the two flat tires to end off the night really made it worse. But let's go. We're in the grill now, trying to get some tires. This is where we had to pull over and shut the we just had lunch the food was really really good but the service was terrible so I don't feel comfortable recommending restaurants um, but yeah I mean if you recognize it if you're from the Negro area and you know it then you know it but Guys, we sat there for so long before them um, put in the order. So I had to go up and be like, um, how long is it going to take? They never put in the order. 
Never come check by way. None of that. Only one time after we get the food if they come check. But anyways, let's go to the beach. I don't know if y'all can tell, but I just pulled out my hair because straight here and summer in a Jamaica don't agree. So, this is now the look. on a two wheel drive it's a cheaper too smaller engine but it can work in yeah I'm about to get a sewing and this is what my hair is looking like I feel like my hair is really thin like I don't know it just it may not look thin but it is really I just got my ends trimmed too, but she said I need to change my shampoo and use something more moisturizing. I'm heading to country to see my grandparents and I'm going to get them some KFC. Chad was like, you should stop in Wonderful and buy them some KFC. Grandma loves Kentucky fried chicken. She don't call it KFC. She said she wants our Kentucky fried chicken. So that's what I'm going to get her. Currently driving on Old Harbor Road. I'm going to take the toll at Old Harbor instead of going on the Spanish Town toll and then going on from there because it'll save me chat to like 900 600 and something dollars um worth of toll and I had to buy gas so yeah oh boy it's been a while it's been a long long term but yeah I brought my uniform them people just drive so reckless I brought my uniform and I have my flat attendant makeup on so grandma and grandpa can see me in my flat attendant uniform. Am I here? I don't know if I showed you guys my hair, which I think I did. But um everything just went tying Mwah! perfectly. So um until I get to Mandeville, I will see you guys. Bye bye. <laughs> Mandeville and I just bought KC and Jesus Louise it's so expensive but gotta do what you gotta do so let me tell y'all what I bought um well this don't tell me nothing I got three meal deal one big deal and the 10 piece hot wings combo Ooh, six thousand dollars my Jesus I'll be right back Got my bevs. Don't judge the status of the car right now, okay? And I have my my uniform shoes because, like I said, I brought my uniform, so um, grandma and grandpa can see me in it, and that's why I have my red lipstick on right now. But there's five meals. I'm just so excited. I would like a link up on my people in Mandeville, but we don't have that much time. Um, so yeah, I'm I need to check everything because that was a lot. Alrighty. Alright, I turn on the AC because it's really hot. This is this is my chippies. That's one. That's two. Why don't give me bear wing? I'm gonna mix it. Uh oh.
That's three. This is my potential breakup slot. This is mine. That's amazing. I'm gonna put that right here. And then, uh, this is Chad's. So what I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna put everybody else's in the bag. So when I reach, I can take out Chad on. and give them theirs. Woo! It's getting hot. Like I was saying, I would have linked up my mandible people them, but I don't have enough time and there's two people that I would love to see. But like I said, I don't have enough time. Um. So I'm gonna head to go see grandma and grandpa now. I do have my cousins here in Mandeville and I would love to see them. So let me try to call them mother real quick. But I don't want to see them when I have the KFC. I just don't have enough to buy like 13 people KFC. I really don't. So I'm gonna try and link up with them after I come back from Chilani because it would look bad if I come and say hi to them. I have the KFC here and I can't give them any because I don't have enough, you know? So. I'm not that person. Anyways, I don't talk more than I'm allotted to talk right now. So I'll see you. Later. No, I'm coming. Let me turn off this AC. Yeah, they don't know. But I'm here. Okay. Let's go out and see. Let me grab my phone so I can get pictures. All right, you're gonna get a little bit shaky, guys. Sorry. Hello. Oh, <laughs> What's right? Good, how are you? Good, how are you? Good, how are you? So, uniform. So, 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 when you're talking to salute, salute your baby. I took some pictures with the grandparents and I spent some time with them, but I'll pop the pictures in on the side over here. Um, we're going to walk over to the basic school where I went to go visit my baby cousin and see one of my old long-time teachers. So, Wait, I'm still following so far. Um, so yeah, I'm going to spend some time with them. I'm going to put my camera to charge and. Mm -hmm. Time to go. Say bye, bye, Grandma. <laughs> Love you. All right, sure, Grandpa. Say bye, bye. Hi B squad, a lot has transpired since you last saw that clip of grandpa, but I'm actually in the airport now. My last day off is tomorrow. Today is the 11th, tomorrow will be the 12th. A fan is about to come around, so if it get windy every now and then, that's why. And I'm gonna be quick because music's playing, so let me hurry up. I just met a subscriber, her name is Vanessa. I'm gonna pop up some pictures here of the two of us. She is so amazing, so funny. Such a lovely lady and Vanessa everything that you're going through now it's not forever and just know that things come to those how much how much is it karma that is it karma girl for them karma up home just know that and I can't wait to see what you have in store and we don't talk about what we talked about already so that is coming as well um, but yeah this is Vanessa She's I can't. She's so she's so nice. We may end up on the same flight tonight. Um, hopefully, I, I make it on that flight. 
but I got some food from Gloria's. I'm gonna show you it really quickly. It's some lobster and festival, and yeah, it's. <laughs> I didn't make it on the floor. I did not make it on the flight, so now I'm outside waiting to get picked up. Um, that's where I go. I've never experienced this before, and I had to experience it at least one time in my flight attendant career. So, yeah. If I had tried to get on the American Airlines flight, I'm more likely, like literally, up 99.9% .9 would have made it in. Um, but I was trying to get on the JetBlue flight, so. When I tell you about 20 people come on bunks me down at the bottom of the list, I said, Jesus, mm -mm, this not look good. Oh! My fault. Anyways, that's a sign for me to get up off the camera. I'm going to eat and figure out the move for tomorrow. I already listed myself on both the Montego Bay to JFK flight for American and I got put over on the next flight tomorrow for JFK for Montego Bay for Kingston to JFK with uh, JetBlue so we'll see if I can make it on that one as well and I'm also on the two something flight for American from that one though I don't like because that one is Kingston to Miami Miami to New York and I really don't want to do a connecting flight so fingers crossed I get on the early one Anyways, bye-bye. Good morning and welcome to the second part of the vlog. I haven't done a work trip vlog in a very long time, so come with me to Barbados and Miami. I hope you enjoyed the little snippets of my birthday holiday in Jamaica um, with the grandparents and Chad and Kai and everybody. But now we gotta work. So we're heading to Barbados. We're gonna spend about 15, by the time we reach the hotel, 13 hours, if we're being 100% honest. Um, and then we come back to Miami and we lay over in Miami for 17, 18 ish hours and then fly back to New York. I had plans this weekend, but uh, out the window. <laughs> I got this trip last night. Off the skin of my teeth i did bid for it though but that's nice anyways make sure you like comment share and subscribe i haven't been vlogging consistently in a in like a month so if i get real awkward that's just why if the video gets a little cutty cutty like that's just why just bear with me the next video will be a lot better Bye. we are in barbados so the miami it was no more than an hour and 40 minutes and then by the time we finished deplaning and found our gate it was 15 minutes until boarding by the time we got on the plane did all our checks it was time to board so yeah um we're now in barbados we're in bridgetown are we in bridgetown yet or are we just no, we where christchurch Christ excuse me sir this is christchurch on the ABC highway Very nice. Henry Ford roundabout so if any of you are from Barbados please drop a Barbados flag drop the Beijing flag drop some huh oh, okay let me know and yeah let's show some love let's show some inter-caribbean love um if you're not from barbados and you want to rep your country drop your flag let's just show some straight love in the comments all right ready this is one of my crew members he's from saint vincent and the grenadines if you're from saint vincent drop a flag drop a comment so, so, wait i don't talk like that <laughs> tell them something hey, yeah want me to tell them we're going on a day about a St. Vincent slang something. No, we can't do that. Mm. We can't do that. Anyway. Because the first thing that comes to mind in 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 a vlog appropriate. <laughs> <laughs> we'll be back to him. We'll be back. But this is Barbados. Well, this is the hotel. We're gonna walk to Chefet later. So we're just trying to enjoy what we can now. If y'all don't remember, I already have a Barbados vlog 
um, it's Barbados and Costa Rica so make sure you go and check those out I know y'all loved it the people that did watch it thank you so much for the support um, but if you want to see more of the hotel definitely go and check it out I didn't do a room tour this time around the rooms are very similar the only thing is what you can see from your balcony but other than that it's a very same layout so please go and check it I'll link it up here somewhere I'll also try to remember to link it in the description box if not you can go on my channel and type in Barbade Barbados um, and it will come up so you want to walk down to the beach I feel bad the sun will come out again no more so let's go I wanna love you It's my crew member. This is Chelsea. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Girls cute. Girls cute. <laughs> this is Max. Max. Maybe cut what happened? Oh, oh shit. This is Max. Hello. This is Winita. She subscribed to me. Winita, big up yourself. Big up. Big up. The hey, only, the only, the only, the only. No, you're not. You're not in there. The only, the. It's not in there. The only. Picture me. Why is Max? Sometimes about I don't mommy? know. And then when she posts it, I'm like, bruh. Like, why would you why post that? Mommy, my mom does. Post? Like the picture she posts and what I just post look like two different people. I'm like. <laughs> <laughs> your mom, mom posts your pictures. Mom yes. does that too. Aww. Like. Alright, mommy does that as well. She'll post like for my birthday that just passed. Mommy posted like some good pictures and some nice pictures that I took and post. She screenshot. But then she have some picture where somebody else posts and the picture of them just look. I was like, mom, thank you so much. I love you. I really appreciate it. But some of these pictures and then she had the, the audacity to send me the laughing emoji like why would you post these pictures of me I like that. your mom did that to you she yes. posts some nice pretty picture in her and then the fourth picture or the fifth picture is some ugly picture where like it, it's a balance no the world does not need to know i'm not the, i'm not the airbender like i don't need no balance <laughs> it's just one good picture Balance. Just one good picture and done. Like, no balance. Just, give me the good ones, like. just post the pictures I post, and she does. She screenshot the picture. Yeah, she screenshot the pictures that I post. Right. And then she post for your own. Don't post your own pictures. <laughs> and she just takes. Oh, if you have a child, don't post the pictures you take. I'm promising you. Mommy, mommy knows best. <laughs> just post the pictures you screenshot that your child posts. We need to. Is a mom. And um, Chelsea's a mom. What? So like, they have kids. My kids. Okay. My kids look ugly, and I look cute. I'm so posted it. <laughs> Did y'all hear that? It's gonna make them tougher. Did y'all hear that? I'm gonna make sure the zoom. I'm gonna make sure I zoom in over here so y'all can hear. I'm telling you, parents do that. One ugly shot makes things real. One ugly shot makes things real. Don't do that. And I quote. What you say? I'm supposed to have standards. Like and I and I and I supposed to have standards. In real life. And I supposed to have standards. <laughs> if you meet me in real life, lucky you. Let me turn the what? camera so you can see. social media to you? When my when my parents post pictures of me, me just be like, let me unfriend you now before anybody ah. find me. <laughs> don't tag me. Don't tag That's me. Don't, don't. I, I put up what time where it was like, I have to be approved to be posted on my page. That's so smart. Other than that, I yeah. don't post anything. Like, they and tag me in and I'm like, nope. And I can't nice. tag me big, big, big any picture. I'm going to say, right, delete that. <laughs> <laughs> well, my mama delete don't know it. how to use social media. So well, lucky you. Yeah. Could tell me, my beauty, my handsome son, mommy, do you see that picture? <laughs> That's <laughs> handsome too? Take it down. Take it down now. Yeah, 
All right, we're getting ready now to oh, go. Jesus. We're gonna walk to Chefet. Cause I'm very hungry. Regardless, me and Max are gonna walk. If nobody yes. else don't come with we, me and Max. I'm, I'm coming come. as well. Oh, You're coming. Oh, yeah, not the one that was. Do it again. Chefet. Chefet. <laughs> no, no, no. Cause people gonna be like, yo, what, what she got against Chefet? I just really want some lamb curry. If we if we, if we walk past the lamb restaurant. curry place, no, the mall. Yeah, when we go yeah, past, it's yeah, called yeah. Chutney. Chutneys. Okay, we're gonna yeah, check it out, guys. But we're picking up all our towels and all our garbage because we're not nasty people, we're not dirty people. We, we leave the beach clean and nice and pretty. So when you go to the beach, do the same. Please don't leave your garbage on the beach because, come on, you're deteriorating the, the beauty of the place. So. Alright, we're gonna pick up all this towel and I'll be back with you when we're walking to Chef Ed. <laughs> We are heading now to Chefet. We're gonna walk and see some of the nightlife in Barbados. I'm gonna meet my crew downstairs in the lobby, and this is what I'm wearing. Great top from Victoria's Secret and shorts from American Eagle. So I'm in the lobby now and I'm a tad bit late. So I hope they're waiting on me. <laughs> Alright guys, we walk into Chefet, which allegedly is a 41 minute walk. I don't think so. I think it's gonna take us like 30 minutes, 15 you, you max. You've seen me in action today. I give up immediately. But see them already are talking and joking and laughing and slow down with each other. These are my crew members guys. We look out for them. We look out for one another. We love one another. It's kind of crazy how quick the relationship forms but we just met each other this morning but look at you think they've known each other for so long right but we just met each other so it's kind of crazy we're not dressed for like nightlife but if we check out any more than food it's a saturday night in barbados so they're saying the gap is a nice place to check out and we'll see how it goes so stay tuned for that you know Make sure you like up the video now guys. I'm not just, I'm not, you know. And I'm not doing it for likes either. I'm doing it because I just want to share. So it goes a long way when you like, subscribe and comment. Bye. It's your finest. And I said the thing I drop in at this Fuck, fight, make me clap, it now I miss The thing that no shit on the gun, the mask Cause the baby them sick, miss me I'm in a field to a dem up in at this Fuck, fight, make me clap, it now I miss The thing that no shit on the gun, the mask Intellectual murder people edition Kakam by a full of gun, by a man Then I wanted to be and be here I don't know Upstyle fries and what? Did you get sauce? I did. Okay, good. Everybody good? Everybody another happy? leg. Yeah. Another leg. Um, what's it called? Well, a regular dinner. Regular dinner. Regular dinner and fries. another wing Decided thing. This is our first time. Well, two of our first times <laughs> trying Chef It. So, what do you think of initial? Of the fried chicken yet. Okay. I'm biased and it's the greatest thing in the world. Get out, you're <laughs> such a liar. <laughs> no, but we're not dissing anybody in Barbados. Our chef it. But I love it, I could say it. We're gonna eat our food and then we're gonna come back with our final reactions of this specific meal.
Good morning, good morning, good morning. So, we're heading now from Barbados to Miami. Second day of the three day trip. And I'm quite early, even though I was supposed to wake up at 4 a.m. I slept for an extra 25 minutes. It's now eight minutes after five. Pickup is 5.30 and I'm all done. And I attribute that to not having to rush and figure out what to do with my hair. And yeah, I even ironed my uniform this morning, but don't follow my standards. I normally hire, um, normally, I just said a word, iron. <laughs> my uniform the night before to make it easier and to get more sleep but i'm all ready so i'm gonna lock up my bag i even pack my lunch kit and everything but i don't want to be that person where i am ready and i'm still running late i don't want to be that person so i really want to get downstairs 10 minutes before I pick up and just breeze you know Guys, this was such a fun experience. The crew is so, so, so amazing. Chelsea, Max, Winita, so amazing. They're so funny, kind. I couldn't have asked for a better crew to spend the evening in Barbados. Um, I think the flight back to New York, back to Miami will be three hours and 45 minutes. That's what I'm clocking it as in my head. Even though on Google it says four hours, 10 minutes, I think it's giving 345. It's always less than what they tell you, like on paper. When you get on, it's always a shorter flight. Um, Yeah, that's really it. I have my card again. Here, not walking around with a jacket anymore it's not that cold anymore to be walking around with a jacket the cardigan is more than fine and it's small enough to push in my suitcase or tuck in between my bag handles where the jacket was just so huge and like lumpy but there's no snow there's no ridiculously cold weather that I'm going to like for the most part everywhere that we're flying to now is a decent temperature where the cardigan and a long sleeve is good. I'm really glad. <sighs> At this point, I'm gonna be rambling on, so let me put away all these things and yeah, I'll see y'all downstairs. My love, I love being your love. I'm trying to show you up. You are no, but the, she really the latest girl. She really my favorite girl. I'm loving the way.